So we've been wonderfully learning um, all about how Jesus Christ has brought us uh, back to God and brought about the peace uh, because of the fact that we were God's enemies. We were at war with him uh, by our sinful natures, refusing his rule over our lives. And the Apostle Paul he is continuing to describe how Jesus went about bringing that remarkable peace. And today we're in Ephesians chapter 2 and verse 15. Uh, and let me read the verse. So, so Jesus established this astonishing peace between ourselves and God by setting aside in his flesh the law with its commands and regulations. His purpose was to create in himself one new humanity out of the two, thus making peace. There's so much in there, isn't there? Um, so, so how did Jesus bring about this peace? Well, by setting aside in his flesh the law with its commandments and regulations. He, he lived, he came down to earth as a man, like you and me. Remember, he was tempted in every way like you and me. Now, I find that remarkable. You think of the ways that you're tempted in. I mean, I mean even the fact that you're tempted by such things, it, it, it's shocking, isn't it? And yet, remember, it's not a sin to be tempted. The sin is falling into temptation. But all those ways we are told, even those ones that shock us, that we should be tempted by such and such a thing, Jesus was tempted by every single one of them, yet did not sin, didn't give in to temptation. And he lived that perfect life. And the standards of the law, the requirements, the regulations were a perfect life. And so Jesus became that perfect sacrifice. And so he met God's requirements. And what was his purpose? His purpose was to create in himself one new humanity. It, it wasn't just right the Greeks and the Gentiles, the Jews and the Gentiles, you're just becoming one. No, Jesus was creating this brand new whole humanity. Because remember, what are we in Christ? We're a new creation. As the song goes, no more in condemnation. And it finishes again, it's the reference to peace. And out of the two, thus making peace. Only Jesus can do this. Only Jesus was perfect. Only Jesus has the ability to get you and I right with God and at peace with him. Hallelujah. What a saviour.